All right. It's the 18th of August, 2016, and I'm up in the Gettysburg section at Hollywood, doing a little meandering babble about the history of these guys coming up here. Most of them were laid in Gettysburg right after the battle up until 1872 I think let me check this date again here but yeah the first first shipment came into Rockets Landing on the 15th of June 1872 there were uh, 279 plain wooden boxes unloaded that had about 700 bodies in it um, they were unloaded at Rockets Landing that afternoon there's only 200 of them identified I believe and um, took them five days to actually do the ceremony up here when they brought them back into up in here to be buried but had thousands and thousands of people on 20th of June 1872 when they reburied these guys. That was the first of many shipments coming up from or coming down actually from Gettysburg. So, but here it is. Gettysburg section of Hollywood. It took them two and a half hours to unload. Uh, everything and it was the Powhatan Steamship Company that delivered the first group if anybody wants to get into the minutia of that but uh, yeah 708 Confederate soldiers out of the first grouping there were 239 that Weaver was able to identify and he put them in individual boxes uh, 70 of the soldiers, Virginia, 49 Alabama, 34 Mississippi, 28 South Carolina, 18 North Carolina, 11 Louisiana, 8 Florida, 7 Tennessee, 4 Texas, 4 Maryland, 2 Georgia, 1 Arkansas, 3 unknown states. And um, I'm reading this from a book on Hollywood that I got. But... Uh, there were 325 of these remains that were buried on Nicholas Cadore's land. They were definitely Pickett's command. Uh, they were placed in 27 large boxes that were marked with the letter P. Ten large boxes marked with an S held 11, 111 soldiers exhumed uh, from the site of the 2nd Corps Hospital on the Widow Schwartz farm. One large box labeled A suffice for the 11 Confederates were buried on David Shriver's land. Box B contained the remains of 12 soldiers from the Moses McLean family farm. Uh, box D held 10 remains from the Pitzer farm, Emanuel Pitzer farm. Thinking that uh, Garnett was probably among the unidentified in that shipment. And um, There were, I'm trying to look at how many here. Yeah, Pickett attended the ceremonies in Bowdoin, James Lane, Patrick T. Moore, and more, more than a thousand Confederate soldiers also partook in the ceremonies. It's interesting. <laughs> 